All right, here we're looking at Baldor's kicking, and we're really trying to add a bit of distance and penetration to her kick. Okay, so if you had a look at them, which kick do you think went further? Okay, so we'll scroll back. All right, and the things we're looking at to start with that Bell's doing really well. Okay, if we look at that ball grip, um, she's getting good coverage on the front panel with one, two, and three, and then she likes to get two fingers on the back panel. So really good there. Um, as we're scrolling through, let's have a look at the lift of the ball. Okay, so we're lifting it to chest level. The ball's on a horizontal plane on both. Okay, and her eyes are firmly fixed on the ball. So that's really good there. At this point, the balance arm comes off. Okay, so you can see both, it's consistent. Both balance arms are coming off once she gets it to the apex of her lift, all right? So from here, things look a little bit different. Okay, she's guiding the ball down. Okay, she's losing contact around about there, okay, in both kicks. And most of that ball is below her waist, which is good. Okay, so most is below the waist. But from here, let's have a look at which kick do you believe? Okay, we'll just move this across a bit and this one across a bit. Which kick do you believe is going to go further? Okay, so look at the different body positions. This one here, okay, we're leaning back slightly. And this one, we're more upright. And we can also look at the head position. Um, head position versus this head position here, okay? So on the... We'll clear them. On this one, clearly the eyes are just down and there's no tuck of the neck, okay? So she's not pushing down like that. Where here, clearly she's looking down and there's that little tuck of the neck, which is um, making her a little bit more hunched over. The ball position is very similar, okay? So we always like to say that ball is upright and slightly forward. So this one up the top might be a little bit more forwards. And you can see her foot is really firm in both occasions. So her foot is really good. All right. The only other difference is this lower leg here is completely vertical. And this one is a little bit stretched out. So for me, it is clear which one will go further here. And that is this bottom picture. Okay. So this bottom picture will go further because the ball here is a little bit more upright. She's contacting it a little bit more out in front. Okay. And she's leaning back a little bit, which is going to allow a greater leg swing and a bit more power and a bit more um, penetration with her kick. So the big thing is the difference in angle with the body, okay? So you can see here, okay, if we go like that compared to that, okay, there's a huge difference in the angle um, of the body there, okay? So... From here, let's have a look at the leg swing. And you can see the difference in body shape again, okay? There's a big hunch going on here, okay? So this sort of C shape. And now we've got a nice sort of upright and a strong balanced leg and a nice leg swing. Okay, you can see the leg swing here is a bit higher compared to the top one, okay? As we keep going through, all right? Again, leg swing going up here and leg swing to there. Okay, so there's no doubt that this kick here is going to get more elevation and more penetration than this one here. So hopefully Bell now is going to be able to penetrate the ball a little bit longer because her short kicking is absolutely going beautifully at the moment. Okay, so just that difference in body position okay, is going to allow a little bit more momentum and penetration through the footy. The last one that we can look at is... They're actually two different styles of kick. So this one up here is going to be a foot down kick. So we're looking at that. She's kicked. And watch what she does. She's going to land. We'll clear that. She's going to land on her foot. Okay, so that's she's landed on her foot after she kicked. Whereas when we look at the bottom one, let's see what she lands on. She lands on her balance leg after she kicked. Okay, so she's landing on this one here. So the top one is going to be your foot down kick and this one is landing on the balance leg. That means that the landing on the balance leg, we can kick it a little bit further. The top one, the foot down kick, is more for a lower, flatter kick um, that allows for maybe that accurate 15 to 30 metre kick. All right, so Bella, let's watch her in the next game, see if she can get that penetrating kick down the line or if she's 40 metres out, let's back her in. I reckon she'll drill it.